Hi guys, it's in Amka 4 here with the Galaxy S3 smartphone. We're going to take a look at how to move photographs that you've taken with your camera application to the micro SD card and how to set your camera application so that all future photos that you take are automatically saved to your micro SD card because I've had a couple of questions regarding these. So first of all, if we load up the camera application, I hit it hard enough rather, there we go, and we can see during the previews, previous photos I've taken of the kids and whatnot there so to set this so that all future photographs are saved to the SD card you can see there it's got a little symbol in the corner just stating a picture of the phone just symbolizing that it's currently saving to the phone's internal memory so what you do is hit the cog in the corner for settings scroll right the way down to bottom where it says storage and it says phone tap it so that it says memory card and that's it and then come out of that and then you'll see that little symbol in the top right of that camera app there is now changed to like a micro SD card symbol just symbolizing that it's now saving to the SD card and what we'll do is just take a quick photo there you go so that should have already gone to the SD card now what we'll do just to show that that has gone to the SD card we'll go to my gallery and you can see there the previous photos are taken on the phone are still in their original location on the phone itself but the new photo that I've taken at the desk is there on its own as a folder being on the SD card so what we now want to do is move the photographs that we've taken up from the phone to the SD card okay and what you need to do is from there load up our file explorer and for the purpose of this video I'll just use the standard one that comes with the phone which is the my files one so it's the yellow folder one there just tap on that and then what you need to do is navigate to where we initially had the photos stored which were on the phone so we'll go to SD card scroll down to where you get to DCIM tap on that and then go to camera and you can see all the photographs that I've taken there which were saved on the, the phone's internal memory and we want to move those so we'll hit menu and just from the menu here you can see you can you've got options of copy or move whoops I don't want to copy I want to move it so I'll go back hit menu and then move and then select all the ones that you want to move I'm going to do all of them so I'll just tick the top one then hit done and now it says move to where so we'll select the external SD card and then you can see there the phone has already created a DCIM folder and if I, and it's already created the camera folder so select that and then we just want to copy them in there or move them in there rather so we hit done at the top and it says move and there we go it's moved them all to the SD card as well as the the first photograph that we had taken with the desk as well there so now if we come out of that and go into our gallery there we go you can see there's no photographs there that were showing the camera symbol to be the from the phone itself so that those have moved now if we hit on where it says camera you can see it's got all the photographs that we just moved to the SD card as well as the one that we've just taken out of the desk so that's how you save all the existing photographs to your micro SD card as well as all future photographs that you take with the camera application to the SD card as well no routing needed, just work straight off the bat as it is. Any questions or comments that you guys have got, hit them up and down in the comment section down below there. Hit subscribe from the button up top there if you haven't already done so, just to check out some of our forthcoming videos. Thanks for watching, have a good day, and we'll see you next time.